I guess Biomecha doesn't count as armored units. Because this guy's supposed to... I thought this guy counted as an infantry. Okay, so this is going to be a low, a long slog to get rid of a Corruptor. I can't retreat. I, I really, really cannot withdraw from this. I need to punish him. Four damage, that's, that's respectable. Going first again. This Reaper is back up to eight strength, so we're going to use him first and keep focusing on a Corruptor. Nice! Disrupted him, and he's disabled. I'm sorry, uh, and shocked. So we have to up I have to do it with this one guy. Oh! Can I stop one point of damage? No! I take one point. He didn't kill it. My Vindicator sur survives it? Let's see. Can I get a lucky hit? On the can I get another disrupt on this corruptor? No. Both of us are completely out of fate, but at least I'm going first. So that gives me a small chance to, uh, to do something to them. Nice, three damage thanks to combined arms. I just need him for one point, and now down a corruptor. He'll probably flee if I do that. Destroyed one of them. Next round. He's not running away. I would have. Wow. Okay. I don't know why he. He what he wants to kill a reaper. He wants one of these things dead. Ah, I didn't shock him with the good reaper. Okay, so he'll probably yep go after my armored one. Yes! Oh! Ho, 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 ho. He was unable to put damage on it. And he misses my vindicator. We should look at the pictures by the way, because I keep meaning to do that. So look at the size of this thing. It's just horrible. That's like a Carnifex from Warhammer 40k that's gripping all sorts of horrible weapons. And on our side, we have an awesome looking Vindicator, which has actually been attacked quite a bit and holding its own pretty well. Our Grenadiers haven't really done a whole lot, but then again, with only five attack strength, I wouldn't expect that. Our Emperor's own, doing pretty good with their laser weapon. Our awesome looking Vindicators stomping around, destroying the Corruptors. And we have two range supports over here. Let's see if I can get a lucky Disrupt. Be lots and lots of missing here, I think. Four damage. Every time we hit him. Okay, now now he's running. He knows he, knows he can't win. All right, we did it! We forced him away! He can go first. He, he can run away and lick his wounds. Because we need to do the same. Armor core, back to the base. Where you will repair one of the Reapers. Mechanic's going to come in handy here to help lower the cost of this stuff. Now, more importantly, where did they go? Okay, Oof, we won that fight. Repair you. Iron Wall can move here. Build us a materials team. I still need resources. I would like to claim this location. The Iron Wall's gonna have to fall back to our base, or I need another. I need another unit to attack there, but they're out of supply. So we can deploy a fire base down here. I think will be what I want to do. We can also then deploy until. Uh, well, no, I don't really want to play Intelligence Center. The Normodome. Dome. They're getting generating two human resources here. And they have an army there with critters. Okay, I need to be careful of that. They probably saw my, my one troop there. 
keep him over there. Good news is I know where they're located now, or at least where one of his armies are. This army would be a match for them, honestly. Speaking of that, let's use our technologist to tr Oh! Let's use our geneticist to try for an ascension serum. Nope. Okay, waste of points. We need bait. That was over here that they moved. Okay, so... Well, you can move there. Deploy a fire base. A hidden hive. Wow. I would love to just hit that, but I don't have... That monstrosity is going to be a nightmare to deal with. Ugh. Okay, I send out there just to kill it. What armor are you, Grim Aegis? Really getting tired of dealing with your little scouts over here. So, first we're going to stealth. Destroy that. That'll also let them know I'm around here. We can move them away. I just need to find out where they're located. Over here, we'll go ahead and build a tech team. And then move Grim Aegis back to the base. Then I can start uh, over. Okay. Yeah, we're going to build an intelligence center all the way over here. The reason is because I really want the extra AP. Training left? No, everyone has training done. We have two AP left. It's not a lot really to do anything with. Let's move this guy back into here. Let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, nothing really over there yet. Wow, they are really super far away. Here's their main base. With almost nothing in it, but there's no way I can reach that. So we're going to be forced to deal with these armies first. I don't know where Riley went, either. I have to keep my open open for him. All right, but we have found him as well. I need cards, so let's do it. There's a lot of things I didn't really need. Do another scout unit, though. Let's get him into the base here. And I think I'm going to actually add him to... No, I'll keep him there. Zeus Platoon. This unit's defense roll... 
exceeds the attacker's deep die roll, the difference is applied to damage to the attacker and glitter surface. Any damage received by non-hyperkinetic attacks is modified by a random negative number between 1 and 5. Ugh! Wow! Powered battle armor, good for them. He's gonna be a nightmare to, to chew through. So to help us out, we're going to go ahead and up. Oh, that was not what I wanted to do. I wanted to upgrade the research lab, not the not this. But I guess that's still okay. We have a bigger, a better sniffer. We'll deploy more granite gears over here, which means I'm going to want some training. training can go on them. Then I'm gonna go ahead and try to build some lasers. No, I need energy. Mobile reconnaissance vehicle ashes. Pull you over here. Move you into the town just so I have some defense there. Draw another card. Can I make some lasers? We can deploy them onto the grenadiers. I will then use them to attack this location. This is going first. Their tank will not hit me. Oh! Flank attack two. This guy's gonna actually have four attack dice, not two attack dice. Let's try killing him first. Destroy him. Andrew weapon one and hyperkinetic. It will apply two extra damage. He kind of wasted his fate by going after him. Yeah, now he'll be attacked by everybody because his defense is a little lower. That's okay. We should, we should win this without any trouble. Oh wow, he attacked Emperor's own. That's an interesting target. The tank. Ooh, we'll hurt him. I'll spend some fate to make sure he doesn't die. Let's use the Emperor's own against the raiders. up against them, maybe? No. Okay, so they'll survive another round. Definitely want to attack this guy. Five damage, nice. Two weapons, one point of damage, two for energy weapon, two for hyperkinetic. He's desperately, he's probably desperate to kill that guy, but that won't happen with that attack. I'm gonna use Fnatic. We'll take a point of damage on him. This is the first time I'm actually using this. I want to see what, what that actually does. That's amazing! So for one hit point, I can do a couple of ten dice. I should be using that more often. Blow up the tank. Excellent, he's destroyed. There's no way we're going to capture him. He gets away. Congratulations, Humongous. That's okay. More importantly, we claim the Underhive. So now we're going to get one human, one materials, and one energy. We'll deploy some shock troops in there. And because I have OCD... We'll do this as well. Three points left. They're out of supply! Oh, no, they're not out of supply, their army's too big.